Nate's Nimhard in at the two. And for the Bucks, that small and power forward, it'll be Middleton in at center. You take a look at the Bucks. They had a great season and are expected to control their destiny in this series. I'll tell you what, it'd be a shock if they didn't run through this series. With that said, we know anything can happen. Halliburton against Lillard. Over Halliburton. They get it again. Cordes gets the bucket. And a big board. Here's Nimhart. He's now one for two. It's going to cut the mustard here tonight. You got to stay on top of a guy like that who can play at such a high level offensively. Yep, that one goes. Well, everyone knows Lillard is one of the league's best scorers off the pick and roll, so he chooses this time to make the assist. Looking for an opening. Pass to Nimhart. That's good. From behind the arc. The Bucks rebound. Out of the Kupo finds Middleton. Again, Milwaukee. Pass to Out of the Kupo. Two shots, two makes. Off to a good start. The defense knows Giannis demands 100% effort, but he's still managing it. Middleton outside. Buries it from three. Middleton's got seven points in the game. <laughs> there are looking like a well-oiled machine. Shoots over Halliburton. And it's Milwaukee scoring again. Right side. Out of the Kumpo. The pass to Lillard. Shoots over Halliburton. And it's Lillard. That time on the assist from out of the Kumpo. Lillard's got the second bucket on the night. Building a big advantage early with a terrific all-around performance. Well, if I was big... On the five on the shot clock. Indiana needs to get a shot off. And Siakam gets it to go. The Pacers have gone three of eight so far. Halliburton for three. Sends it home from three-point lead. Here's Ana de Kumpo. Oh, and Giannis hammers it in. Slams it down with two hands. Man, they're really getting aggressive. Here's Beasley. Again. Just unable to do so. With the floater. And Halliburton with the basket. And the Jackson, the pass to McConnell. Tries yet again. And that's two points on the layup. TJ so far. Jackson, left side. That one's good. Over McConnell. Oh, that one bounces around and comes back out. It's been that kind of quarter for him. The shot has just been unreliable. And a slam dunk by... Back to Lillard. Six to shoot. Over McConnell. Yes, on the jumper. He's a producer. It's part of their plan to get him as... 50 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Here's McConnell. Toppin outside. That one's good. On the assist from McConnell. Pass to Crowder. He shoots it. And it's Milwaukee scoring again. Looks like Crowder feels like the green light is all his on that shot. Halliburton has got the ball here for the Indiana Pacers. Four-point game. To the middle. Here's Toppin. And a slam. Got a level against Lillard. To the paint. And it's Lopez. That time on the assist by Lillard. Two-point lead earlier. Beverly, the pass to Anadokounmpo. Right at the free throw line. And he gets the bucket. Giannis. Anadokounmpo's got eight. Giannis looking more and more comfortable each year operating from the mid-range. Something like that. On to Kumpo inside. Working on Siakam. All game long, he's been getting probably better off passing on that shot with him all in his face. Yeah, that's one where you hope if he gets in there the next time, he, he makes a different choice. Siakam finds Halliburton. Here's Nimhart, defended by Portis, and stolen by Beasley. And the Bucks pushing it up now. 
Here's Ana de Kumpo. It goes again. His sixth basket in seven tries. Ana de Kumpo. Clock at six. Here's Beasley. And you can count it. He'll go the line with it. Closing in on four minutes played here in the second quarter. Here's Siakam to end the run. And he lays it up and in. Pascal Siakam. Siakam. Middleton looking around. An open look for Portis. That's good. And so Middleton with the assist. And the Bucks lead by 13. Their ball movement on this run. Six on the shot clock. Offensive rebound. Kicks it out to Ana Kumpo. And he wills that one in. Sinking it right through the back of the iron. Ana Kumpo has got 14 points. And for Indiana, they're shooting only 38% from the floor. Not great. Ana Kumpo with the block. Giannis able to get stuck. Halliburton against Beasley. Back to Turner. That's good. And Halliburton gets the assist. To six run. Pass to Portis. Uses the glass on the layup. Portis has got six. Portis draining the shot. It doesn't matter what the defense did that time. Gallinari. Five on the clock. Up and in on the layup. Gallinari's got his first two points of the night. What focus from the big Italian forward out there. Gallinari is used. Lillard outside. To the inside. Gallinari. Yes. Great play by Lillard to set it up. Nice find by Lillard. He deserves some recognition for that. McConnell with it. Rejected by Lopez. This feels like it snowballed a little bit. Crowder outside. Beasley for three. Sinks the tray. Beasley's got eight here in this quarter. And the Bucks getting another bucket right there. A minute six left to play in the half. Back to Gallinari. He hits the back iron and sinks it. it took a little bit of time, but now he's taking the pen off the cap and putting his mark on this game. And off the jump, they were. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. With the clock winding down. Gallinari for three. Here's Lopez. And finally, they hit one. Lopez has got his second bucket of the night. And without the work they've done on the offensive flat. McConnell against Lillard. McConnell, good. They're very he difficult to slow. Fires it. Can't nail the jumper. Giannis Antetokounmpo has been on display for the Milwaukee Bucks. He had solid production this quarter with scoring and rebounding. All right, stick around. We'll be right back after this. Filling out the wings, it's Beasley and Middleton. And it's Lillard in at the point. That's the five on the floor for the Bucks. And that one drops for him. As Giannis has grown in his physical stature, widening those shoulders, having the old Here's Halliburton. The shot goes down. Very quick game. Oh, great D that time from Portis. And the Bucks with the possession here. On to Kumpo. That's good. And so Middleton with the assist. On to Kumpo's got 18. Feeling more. Back to Portis. The three is up. Hits a three pointer. Nine points in the game. A nice start to the third. Three out of four and looking good doing it. Middleton outside. Here's Portis. And that comes off the assist by Middleton. Middleton's got his third assist of the night. Such a sturdy player. Portis doesn't allow the contact. Alter to Beasley. Here's Middleton. Here's Lillard. Ooh, good finish at the rack off the slick feed. Lillard's got 10. And their offensive game plan is clear. Turner with it. The free ball. Knocks it down from distance. Beasley. Out to the right wing. 
Clock is at three. Three-pointer is up. Middleton drains the triple. How about Middleton saying, you take that, I got some payback for you right here. Lillard against Matherin. Lillard passes to Portis. Oh, and Turner with a block. An impressive shot blocker. Turner's combination of size and timing on defense Andrew is so valuable. Assisted by. Pass to Beverly. Good. And it's Lillard who picks up the assist. Lillard's got assist number nine now. What an effort here on the shot clock. The three is up. Second chance effort. Shakes him. Here's Ana de Kumpo. And that one goes. Now yes. the Bucks need to get up a shot here. Corner shot. Shot's good by Matherin. Ana de Kumpo with it. Wide open look. And off the left side of the rim, it swirls in for him. Ana de Kumpo's got 24 points. Flat out taking the game over, and there's no... Lillard against Taliburton. Now Siakam. Looking to end this cold spell. And then yeah, Siakam up. with the jam. Assist oh, coming in hot. And it's McConnell in for Tyrese Halliburton. Now here's Crowder. Here's Lopez. Oh, and Jackson with the block. Matherin against Beverly. Oh, the block shot grabs it out of the air. This defense gets a lot scarier when Lopez is blocking shots. And Lillard gets it to go. And a moment here to take a look at some hustle stats for the Bucks. Their defense has been on point. And there's been another bonus to what's happened with them tonight, and that's the offensive rebounding. They're boxing out, they're getting up extra shots. It's Lopez, high post. Here's Crowder. And it's Lopez with the jam. Doing the dirty work with that sheer size. Lopez clears the glass and sends it back. Now here's Beasley. Ten points for him. Driving inside. And it's thrown down hard with both hands. And the agility on Beasley's drive. Really tough for the defense to McConnell against Beverly. From 12 feet, McConnell, good. McConnell's got six points. Outside Gallinari. Beverly, the pass to Gallinari. And Gallinari throws it down. A good job of reading the pick and roll there from Patrick. You give him a passing lane. Five on the clock. Over Toppin. Oh, and that one had the right spin on it. It's good. He's got six. Five ticks left in the third quarter of the game. And the slam dunk by Toppin. And Toppin, the toast of the town tonight. Oh, oh no! Count it! It's a coming from an unlikely position. It's the big fellow with the sweetest pass of the day. You know, anytime a guy's in the post and the teammates know he's unselfish, great player movement can create an opportunity just like that. Dermott out there with Walker. Then it's Jackson, and it's Shepard in at the two-guard spot. Walker, there's the block. That's just good defense as Crowder. Connaughton up top. Oh, and Jackson with the block. Out of bounds. It'll be Indiana's ball. Indiana ball. McDermott outside. Yes. And it's McConnell with the assist that time. To the paint. Here's Gallinari. From 13 feet, down it goes. And really, Gallinari makes that one look so easy. He knew before he got the pass he was going to launch that Conchon. jump shot. Clock at six. From the arc. Sinks it from distance. Jonathan's got him. So it looks like the Pacers will retain possession here. Out of bounds. Indiana ball. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the Isaiah second chance points. Jackson. Looks like we're starting. Pass to Walker. Puts it up from 12. Down it goes. 
Pass to Gallinari. Middleton from the outside gets the three to fall. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Just five to shoot. There's Jackson with the three. And the box hit again from deep. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. So it's Indiana with it. Here's Halliburton. Count it. Extra sauce on that one, please, Halliburton. Wow. Middleton against McDermott. Crowder outside. From downtown. Pure from three-point range. A dozen consecutive points off of threes. This defense looks rattled. Their quarter. Halliburton outside. And he makes it. We've seen that more than once. Here's Bochamp. Takes it inside. Good. And when you've got your opponent down. Jackson outside. And that comes off the assist by Middleton. Hard to win games when you allow clean looks from the perimeter. Jackson. Quarter. Pass to Crowder. There's the triple. And another three for Milwaukee. And looking to shoot as many threes as possible. This kind of confidence, impressive to see. Puts up a deep three. The rebound by Jackson. Jackson's got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. Up to the inside. And the dunk by Jackson. Six to shoot. Pass to Beasley. Fires for three. Hits the trifecta. They're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Shooting the ball at only 35% here in the fourth quarter. Inside. Jackson. It's good. Jackson's got seven points here in the quarter. Back to Middleton. Down low. Here's Crowder. And that comes off the assist by... Shocking. And they have to be pleased with how they got this series started tonight. A nice 1-0 lead. The key now is to carry the same energy forward and get that second win. These are the playoffs, so you can't afford to relax. So this one belongs to the Bucks, And it always takes a lot of pressure off a team when they get the win in game one. It's the most important game of the series. They've shown they know how to beat this team. The formula's in place. Now they just have to stick with it for the next few games. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Damien, you guys were in control of this game, more or less, from the opening tip. How satisfying is it to play from ahead? It's a lot of fun. I mean, when the game isn't back and forth and, you know, your heart rate is up, you know, because you're worried about every little thing that happened, every foul call, every every little thing, you know, when you can sit the fourth quarter like we did tonight, um, that's the kind of rest that we want to have. So these type of performances we would like to have more often. Enjoy the moment, guys.